This is the Lamborghini Urus, a 4,850-pound Lamborghini SUV. It does 0 to 60 faster than the Lamborghini Gallardo, and today I'm going to tell you about its quirks and features. Just kidding, I'm not Daddy Doug. Quickly take a listen to this glorious V8 exhaust note. Thank you to Luxury Cars Los Gatos for supplying the Urus for today's video. For more of their inventory, visit the website in the description below. Now the first thing you'll notice when looking up front are the hexagons designed into the front grille near the cruise control sensors. This is kind of similar to the style Audi went with in the honeycomb pattern found in the Audi RS7 grille. Now speaking of the RS7, the Urus actually shares the same engine as the first Lamborghini to come from the factory with turbos. This 4 liter V8 is bi-turbo and puts out 640 horsepower and 627 pound-feet of torque at just 2000 RPM. Now to stop all that mass, say hello to the largest front brakes ever on a production car. These 17.3 inch rotors have 10 piston calipers and these brakes are larger than most wheels on your average compact sedan. 0 to 60 happens in 3.6 seconds and this year is here has the optional 22 inch wheels. You could also opt for the standard 21s or the even larger 23 inch option. As tall as the Urus might seem to you, you can actually lower and raise the car via the various driving modes, which we'll get to in a moment, or this little button in the trunk which makes it easier to load your gold bricks into the back. This air suspension is pretty neat in my book. Just kidding, I'm not an author yet, I don't have a book. But speaking of air, check out these frameless doors. When have you ever seen an SUV like this? Roll the windows down, no frame, maximum air, amazing. Now if you need more space to fit gold bricks, you can fold the rear seats down, and if you opted for the four seat configuration, everybody gets in heated seating in the car. Literally nice ass features. For those in the fancy pants, come up to the front seats with the embroidered Lamborghini logos in the headrest and get a nice massage controlled through the comfort screen, which is just one of three displays in this technology showcase on wheels. Now, if you want, plug your iPhone into the USB port and you've got Apple CarPlay all set to go. It feels just like any run of the mill VW Jetta. You'll feel comfortable in an instant. Don't know where to put your keys or your $10 latte? Not to worry. The Urus has a key cubby in the center console, a wireless charging pad for your phone, and that's right, two cup holders. You can hold $20 of latte in here at a time. Now let's talk driving modes. For those with a big ego, you've got, well, the ego mode, which lets you individually select your driving options, suspension, ride height, steering, and throttle response. If you're willing to let the car do the grunt work for you, select from one of six modes on the Anima selector, which includes the classic Lamborghini Strada, Sport, and Corsa modes, which are meant for street, sport, and track, respectively. Or if you choose to actually go off-road with the Cirrus, you can place it into snow, sand, or slippery road mode. And that's all I can show you today of the Lamborghini Urus, a very interesting and glorious sounding SUV, which I would love to drive. Thanks again to Luxury Cars Los Gatos, and if you'd like to see me driving the Urus in the next video, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment requesting a driving video below. So should you get the Urus? If you could, then you should. Thank you for watching, and enjoy your Lambo. Bye.